generally a sort of quite linear two-seated vehicle, lightweight, and a lot of um, particularly specialised in making them, and one of, one of their most highly produced Liverpool um, types was the Liverpool gig. Um, Anne is driving a Manchester gig. It's a bit more of a loose term, the Manchester gig. It's sort of, because the UN's got a Manchester cart, which is like a four-wheel, uh, two-wheel country vehicle. So the Manchester gig covers probably a bit more loose terminology. But what um, Anne's got here is, again, what we're looking for in these vehicles. Lots of spokes. If you've got a 16-spoke um, wheel, that just shows people have put a little bit of work into making it. And she's got the sprung ends on the traces. So how you name a vehicle um, can be the designer. You get Stanhope gigs, you get Brones after Brones and Brones and um, Stanhope. You design them. It can pertain to perhaps one of the cities they were built in, like Manchester or you know, Stratford gigs or sorts of places. It might be the sort of vehicle. So you can have a stick back or a spindle back gig. Also be called a Dennett gig if you've got the three semi-elliptic springs. Um, you can have a spider gig, like we've got coming out, spider or skeleton gigs. They're 